Your STEM Academy students are engaged with Johnson & Johnson's activity with Vogue International and they're working on something truly unique. Tell us about it. So they're actually getting to design a shampoo bottle just the way that the engineers and designers at Johnson & Johnson would do it. And they're getting to go through the process that professionals out in the STEM community are using to make the products that people see on their shelves every day. So our goal is to reach one million students. Um, to inspire them to pursue careers in STEM 2D. We've added the 2D, which is manufacturing and design to the end of STEM. Um, so here today we've brought our creative experts who are showing the students how to go through the creative process in making their own shampoo or conditioner design from the initial trends and thought process behind you know, what's inspiring them to create a certain variant or whatever it is um, and bringing it to life. Ava, you are working on something called the Mermaid Moisturizer. Tell me about it. Um, it's kind of like a kiwi and coconut um, moisturizer for your hair, kind of like after the beach. Jack, your shampoo bottle looks really good, and I see something fresh basil. How did you think of this idea? Because I have a garden at home and I use it a lot, and there's basil in it. Yes, so the competition is we're going to bring back the renders that they've created and we're going to have our own Vogue International team vote on which they like the best. And then from there, our creative team is actually going to create a professional render and an own mock-up, so an empty bottle mock-up of their shampoo, the winner, whoever wins. So it'll be really exciting for them to have a very tangible example of, hey, I thought from, you know, the start of this to the end of it, here is like something I created. Yeah. That's pretty incredible, Missy, don't you think? Yeah, so it's how proud are you? We're here with Ava Kohler, who was the winner of our Johnson & Johnson uh, Vogue line. They did a STEM activity where the kids designed a shampoo bottle, just like the kind you would see at the store. And then April Ness of Johnson & Johnson helped decide the winner, and they created a real... Uh, display for it, advertising like they would in the community, and created a sample bottle for Ava to take home with her. And then hold up your, and so this is her original, and this is what they turned it into. Um, well, I really like how the bottle looks. The, like the colors they used are definitely a lot better. But um, I'm really excited that I won. It's really. Great. You did it. Yep. Awesome. So we kind of got to learn about how you know you would go from the idea to a final product. Very. Um, so it was a really good learning experience because I learned that STEM can be used in the real world.